Hi, my name is Brian Mahoney and welcome to Easy English Best Java Tutorials. Today we're going to talk about the increment operator. Increment operator, an operator that adds one to its operand. It has two forms, a pre-increment and a post-increment. In its pre-increment form, the result of the expression is the value of its argument after the increment. In its post-increment form, the result of the value of its argument before the increment is performed. Think of it as football. In the NFL, they have a preseason, which is before the season starts. Then they have the playoffs, which is called the postseason, which is after the season. Uh, so the, we're going to look at an example of the increment operator uh, pre and post. So we'll, we've already compiled the program. Now let's run it. Now we look down here. We see Math 1 has incremented from 10 to 11. Math 2 has incremented from 20 to 20. It hasn't changed. But here Math 2 has incremented from 20 to 21. Okay, let's look at the lines and let's look at the code. So first cre we created two uh, uh, integers, um, x and y, and gave them a value of 10 and 20. Then we created two more uh, integer variables, uh, math1 and math2. Uh, math1, we gave it x value uh, with the increment operator in front. And math2, we gave it the x value uh, with the incre increment operator in the back. So when we do a system print out for both of them the first time, uh, the one that's in front or pre, it, it, uh, it, 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 go, it goes ahead and performs its function and a 1 is added to the number 10. But when we look at the second variable, math2, nothing has been added yet because it's post. It just now saw it. So now, after this statement, we put the same uh, code here, and now it it prints out uh, uh, 21, or has now has a value of 21 because it's after the fact. Uh, so let's go through it and clear it and run it one more time. And this time we'll change the. Uh, value of the variables this one to 12 this one to 22 and and this time and I guess I should have changed it right here as well this to 12 because that's the value we changed it to this one to 22 and change this one to 20 to now probably look a little bit better or a little bit more accurate change the values of the variables and you see again it just incremented it one no change uh, uh, here and then when we put the code uh, here uh, it adds one uh, to it uh, post or afterwards so that's a very uh, short uh, tutorial on the increment operator we're going to be using uh, that in our loops which is the next things we're, we're going to begin to cover are our loops thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and make it a great day